All right, welcome back. You're watching Liquid Lunch on Biz TV. I'm John Tobacco. We're just uh, wrapping up hour one here of a, a Wicked Woman Wednesday show. We've had some really tremendous women's perspective today. Kicked it off with Erin Elmore. She's the head of USA Strong, then uh, Zen Sam's model actress, then an activist, and talking about, uh, to us about the power of the naked body um, and how it's coming into these protests at times. It's just absolutely crazy. And uh, Gail Casper trying to give you some tips on how to get back on your feet uh, after the COVID crisis and get off unemployment and start earning some money again. I don't know if you guys know, but way back when, when there was the uh, Occupy Wall Street protests going on, my brother Derek and I organized a counter protest called the Occupy a Desk Get a Job protest. And um, we had some great success. We actually contributed to... Uh, them clearing out the park, and I'm glad that somebody in the NYPD cleared out the Occupy City Hall. Um, but you know, this COVID thing keeps continuing to get crazy, and there are a lot of sources out there. You see the president arguing with uh, Chris Wallace on Fox News Sunday about which test, which graph he was using, which source, Johns Hopkins. Um, Every week we talk about big data. We talk about how you can get involved in the big data economy. And my buddy Joe Hagen joins us to give you some insights from his 30 plus years on Wall Street. Joe's the CEO of Wealth Colony. And Joe, apparently um, you have a little tip here for everybody to learn how to search a uh, COVID-19 database with live interactive dashboards and track shutdown scenarios and all this other stuff. What's this about? Yeah, so thanks. It's always a tough act to follow such beautiful, smart women on a, <laughs> on a Wednesday. So I'm trying to come up with something a little special. And there's a way for you to search COVID-19 data. You can go to explore a, a live interactive dashboard. Very cool stuff. You can even build your own forecasting models um, on different shutdown scenarios in the world. Say, like, I only want to, I only do business in uh, Lebanon, Ireland, and, you know, Guyana. So you can literally create uh, forecasts for your business that way or for just for your life. Um, and it's what I'm really looking at to be the next data dog, and that is a company called ThoughtSpot. ThoughtSpot um, is Google alumni uh, that started the company in 2012. Uh, their competitor was already bought out. Remember, before the IPO, data dog got offered to be bought out. They said no, and they've been taken off since from $8 billion to $30 billion. Um, I think it's still worth $50 billion. But ThoughtSpot you know, we're waiting on an IPO. Um, there's only a few investors. They put about $248 million into it at, a, at, a, at just under a $2 billion market cap. So I'd love to see that opportunity for an IPO in the coming months. Uh, but it's really cool to go to their website and play around with the data. So um, give, you want to give us that website again, Joe, that people can find? It's, the, it, it's just go to thoughtspot.com. Thought spot. One Thought, T-H-O-U-G-H-T, spot. Dot com. Yes. Thought spot. Yeah. I mean, they, they uh, you know, you, you want to look at how big data is merging with like um, artificial intelligence. You know, I was watch, reading an article, a company called Suncor Group basically just came out and said that they had a whole team of staff that with real, these claims reports in the insurance world, it took them two weeks to come up with these reports, okay, to be ready for these insurance claims. When you use ThoughtSpot, they could do that in less than 10 minutes from two weeks with the whole staff. So that's kind of a real-world application out there. Um, the data that they get from Johns Hopkins uh, is what they use, and that's their disclaimer. But it's really cool to see um, to, to, to use their dashboard and see what you could do with COVID-19 and what's going on in the world and how they really merge you know, artificial intelligence with search. So, Joey, now, um, for months, you, uh, you know, I'll do the uh, regular disclaimer, both Joe and I are significant shareholders in InvestView. InvestView has a division of the company called Apex that's engaged in uh, a uh, leaseback model where you can invest in the uh, cryptocurrency mining economy. And uh, many of you inquired, many of you bought Apex models through Joe and, uh, and InvestView. Um, there's a new product that InvestView has out now. Um, I'll remind you, this isn't a solicitation. I am not a financial advisor. But um, 
The Apex special, buy three, get one free, ended on July 15th. And now there's a new program for people looking for passive income. It's a liquid stock. It's uh, eligible for IRA also. Tell us about the preferred opportunity. Yes, it was actually June 30th, and it was buy four, get one free. Ah, but that, all right. that has ceased to exist. Um, <laughs> and, you know, they'll come out with a new program, I'm sure. But in the meantime, the company is preparing for a major institutional deal. And we're just acting as, you know, information providers. We're not advisors, but we show people, and we can certainly show you um, how the deal works, how you can subscribe for it. Um, I have people that can put in a few, you can put in a few hundred dollars, or you can put in a few thousand dollars, or you can put in a million dollars, whatever your comfort level is. If it makes sense to you, you go do it without the middleman. You're not paying the commissions. And at the end of the day, you're getting a 13% return but you're also getting an equity kicker that can mean another 10, 20, 50%, you know, or more return. So um, the interesting thing is for the dividend interest, it is in an escrow account for the next three years. So that really mitigates a lot of risk of making sure you get the 13% return. And they pay this quarterly, they pay this dividend, I'm sorry, monthly. So in one quarter, you can earn more interest than you would in a bank for a year or two. So it's a great deal. So uh, you buy a new class of stock in InvestView. And Correct. this is just informational. Um, it's a it's a preferred class, which gives you mm -hmm. actually a little bit of a higher standing um, in a black swan situation because it's a preferred. And your dividend is 13% annually, accrued monthly, paid quarterly. So, you know, but, you know, 10 grand, you pick up 1300 a year to be simple, right? Uh, yeah, pretty much thirteen uh, fifty. I think it is, to be exact. Yeah, you know. All right.